It's been a substantial investment by Andrew Newton Abbey Borough Council of approximately £5 million, but as you can see, it's a state-of-the-art modern facility, very contemporary, but it also has a purpose for religious services or secular services. So it's not here to satisfy or to solve the issue of cremation demand in Northern Ireland. It's primarily here to provide a fitting and reverent service for the public and the users of it. And that it's very important. So for instance here we offer a 45 minute cremation service. Um, that means when families are here they shouldn't feel rushed. They should feel that they're here for their service and it's very fitting and personal to themselves. When families arrive they'll, they'll enter through our main doors in our foyer and then they'll come into this modern funk, modern ceremony room. It seats 160 individuals. Before that, what's very important is the conversation with the funeral director and arranging the service. So the service can be tailored either to commemorate, to celebrate or indeed remember the deceased. And that's why we've invested heavily in our audio-visual state-of-the-art technology. Following the cremation, that a lot of families will take the cremated remains away and maybe to a favourite place or maybe to a family graveyard. But we're also investing heavily on our Scottern lawn and our memorial options, which we will hope would be a pleasing and fitting place for families to remember their loved ones. Our consultation started on Monday with the residents information day, which was very, very positive. Over 60 residents attended. Today is a funeral director open day for funeral directors, clergy, celebrants, and it's been extremely busy today, but very, very positive. So we're, why we're here, to offer the service of cremation. The emphasis again is on the quality of the service. It's not that we're here to solve cremation demand for Northern Ireland or be in competition with the Rose Loan. It's simply to offer families a different choice. Yes, six services daily from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. And that again should mean that families should be here. They shouldn't be feeling rushed and they shouldn't be mixing with other mourners from other services.